good morning my dear students and uh, this is revision part 2 of chapter integers i have chosen this uh, chapter because in your last uh, class test most of the students were seen that they have a doubt in addition and subtraction of integers so i am going to repeat this class once again and i hope uh, your doubts will be cleared so first topic i have taken addition of integers here we will follow three rules to add integers rule number one if the two integers are positive to find the sum add their absolute values and put a positive sign before it so it is very simple if we have to add two positive integers what we have to do we have to add the two integers and put a positive sign before the sum of the integers i have uh, taken one example for explanation find the value of plus 24 plus plus 6 so here 24 and 6 both are positive so if we find the absolute values of 24 it is 24 and absolute value of 6 it is 6 so sum of the absolute values 24 plus 6 which is equal to 30 therefore the sum of the two integers 24 and 6 is 30 we can put a positive sign before 30 but as positive signs are not written you can simply write 30 For explanation, I have taken one more example. 1, 3, 1, 4 and 3, 1, 4, 2. I have to find the sum. So, absolute value of 1, 3, 1, 4 is 1, 3, 1, 4. Absolute value of 3, 1, 4, 2 is 3, 1, 4, 2. Therefore, the sum of the absolute values 1 3 1 4 plus 3 1 4 2 is equal to 4 4 5 6 the rough work is done in the right uh, right side of the page so rule number two to add two negative integers find the sum of their absolute values and place a negative sign before it so let us explain this with a with an example evaluate minus 24 plus minus 16 so minus 24 is a negative integer and minus 16 is also a negative integer so according to rule number two absolute value of minus 24 is 24 absolute value of minus 16 is 16 therefore the sum of absolute values is equal to 24 plus 16 equal to 40 as both the numbers are negative what we have to do we have to put a negative sign before 40 then again i have taken one example add minus 6290 and minus 2110 so solution for this is absolute value of minus 6290 is 6290 absolute value of minus 2110 is 2110 therefore sum of absolute values 6290 plus 2110 is equal to 8400 so as the 
given numbers are negative both the numbers are negative we have to put a negative sign before the sum so minus 6 to 9 0 plus minus 2 1 1 0 is equal to minus 8 4 0 0 rule number 3 to add a positive integer with a negative integer find the difference of their absolute values and place the sign of the greater addend with greater absolute value before it so here we have a different difference uh, from the previous two rules we have to find the difference of the absolute values of the given numbers and put the sign of the greater number so here plus 14 plus minus 11 plus 14 is positive addend and minus 11 is negative addend you know what is addends addends are the numbers which are added so absolute value of 14 is 14 absolute value of minus 11 is 11 therefore the difference of absolute values 14 minus 11 equal to 3 now 14 is greater than 11 and 14 is positive here so the sum is also positive the result what we have got a 3 that will be positive so plus 14 plus minus 11 is plus 3 or equal to 3 so checking with another addition of a positive number and one negative number here plus 37 plus minus 51 absolute value of 37 is 37 and absolute value of minus 51 is 51 so we shall find the difference of 51 and 37 which is equal to 14 now 51 is greater than 37 but 51 is a negative number as the greater number is bearing a negative sign so our answer is also negative therefore plus 37 plus minus 51 is minus 14 the next topic is subtraction of integers here also we shall follow one rule to subtract one integer from another we find the additive inverse of the integer to be subtracted and add to the other integer so we shall see with examples subtract minus 475 from minus 1346 so we have to subtract minus 475 from the given uh, number minus 1346 so what we shall do we shall uh, do addition only with what with additive inverse of the number to be subtracted the number to be subtracted is minus 475 so we have to find the additive inverse of minus 475 uh, and then add to the other integer so the difference is equal to minus 1346 plus additive inverse of minus 475 equal to minus 1346 plus additive inverse of minus 75 is plus 475 the opposite of 
minus 475 is plus 475. This is sum of one negative and one positive integer. What we have got minus 1346 plus 475. Here one number is positive and one number is negative. So what we have to do? We have to find the difference of the absolute values of the numbers. So absolute value of minus 1346 is 1346. Absolute value of 475 is 475. So difference of absolute values 1346 minus 475 is equal to 871. The greater number 1346 is bearing a a negative sign so the result is also negative so we have minus 1346 minus minus 475 is equal to minus 871 the next question is evaluate minus 389 minus 216 so again we have one negative number minus 389 and one positive uh, number 216 we have to subtract 216 from minus 389 so according to rule a difference is minus 389 plus additive inverse of 216 now uh, we have to add two negative numbers one is uh, minus 389 and another is minus 216 so here put the numbers are negative so what we can do we can use a shortcut method we shall put a minus sign before the sum of the numbers so I have done minus within bracket i have added 389 and 216 which is equal to 605 so the sum of minus 389 plus minus 216 is minus 605 so this is the answer for addition of the given numbers now next question is evaluate number one 23 plus within bracket minus 17 plus within bracket minus 11 plus 16 what we shall do we shall separate the positive and negative integers first so what are the positive and negative integers 23 and 16 are positive integers and 17 minus 17 and minus 11 are negative in integers so i have written 23 and 16 in one group and minus 7 and uh, 17 and minus 11 in another group now add the similar type integers so if we add the same integers um, the positive integers and negative integers I get 39 plus um, I have to put one negative sign before the uh, sum of the negative integers 17 and 11 so 39 plus minus 28 so again we have got one positive and one negative integer here so what will be the sum sum is the difference of absolute values of the numbers so uh, absolute value of 39 is 39 absolute value of, of uh, minus 28 is 28 so difference of 39 and 28 is 11 39 is greater but 39 is positive so our answer 11 is also positive now i have taken another example minus 19 plus 17 minus 6 minus 4 so we shall again separate the positive and negative integers 
so we can see that 17 is added to minus 19 then 6 is subtracted and 4 is also subtracted so we can write 17 plus within bracket minus 19 plus additive inverse of 6 plus additive inverse 4 so additive inverse of 6 is minus 6 additive inverse of 4 is minus 4 so writing the negative integers within a bracket and putting a minus sign before the bracket I can write like 17 plus within bracket minus within bracket 19 plus 6 plus 4 equal to 17 plus within bracket minus 29 so it is the same case as rule 3 of addition one number is negative one is positive so we have to find the difference of absolute values of the integers absolute value of 17 is 17 absolute value of minus 29 is 29 now difference of absolute values is 29 minus 17 which is equal to 12 but here 29 is greater than 17 in general but 29 is bearing a minus sign so our answer is also have a minus sign before it so 17 plus within bracket minus 29 is equal to minus 12 from the sum of minus 5376 and 3744 subtract the sum of minus 2150 and 1125 so we have to find the sum of minus 5376 and 3744 and from there we have to subtract the sum of minus 2150 and 1125 so first we will find the sum of minus 5376 and 3744 uh, we shall find the absolute values uh, of minus 5376 which is equal to 5376 and absolute value of 3744 which is equal to 3744 as one number is negative one is positive we have to find the difference of absolute values to find the sum so 5376 minus 3744 equal to 1632 but 5376 is greater than 3744 the greater number is 5376 and it has negative sign before it so the sum will be also negative because the greater number is negative so we have to put one negative sign before 1632 same way we shall find the sum of minus 2150 and 1125 and we get minus 1025 the same way we have to find the sum of the other two integers now what we have to do we have to subtract the sum of minus 2150 plus 1125 from minus 5376 plus 3744 so minus 5376 plus 3744 is minus 1632 and minus 2150 plus 1125 is minus 1025 so we have to subtract the two values minus 1632 minus within bracket minus 1025 so how can we do this we have to find the additive inverse of 1025 so minus 1632 plus additive inverse of minus 1025 
equal to minus 1632 plus 1025 one number is negative one is positive if we find the sum we get it to be minus 607 so I am giving you some addition and subtraction and simplify to do so you try to solve the questions and send it to me before 6 o'clock today if you have any doubt you can ask me and this is all for the day have a great day ahead